I got married in 2007. Dikatora mkadz ni mchato. I'm the only boy in my family. But before I married my wife, high school sweetheart wangu. My mother vai even mwana wa basawira wa wabaida kuti ndirore since childhood. Vai to muti murowa. So ndakazoenda ku boarding school, ndakura ndayaruka. All this time she was still trying to pinch me with this girl. Mwana wa basawira wavo kuti ndidana ni naye, but I wasn't interested. I dated my wife from form 2 till varsity. All these years mama I tried chete to make me have an eye on that girl. So zvadaro ndakavati nda kuda kurora. Vakati pano pano ya murora uyu. Not msikana wako wa kuda ye. It took a year till her brothers, baba wangu ne siblings, went behind her back and married my wife. Pakupere kwa that day vazo udzwa na natete, mama drove from Harare to Penalonga kumusha. Murora kapere kwa vasi. On my wedding she did not an- attend. She flew to Canada kumkwasha wao. Ndakachata mai vangu vasipo. Dedi kumira na mai guru, a sister because she refused to partake in this. Muchato wakaitwa wakapera, vanhu vakadzokera kudzimba dzavo. Mai vangu havana kuuya kumba. Hava uye futi kumba kwangu since I married in 2007. Tunas all these years atina mwana ne mkadzi wangu. Ama dzakaenda kuvakumbira kuti sori henyu mwana akarora mkadzi wa mama singadi but nothing changed 15 years now no mwana or sign of pregnancy or miscarriage hayo vedue if i sent her money she sends it back grocery the same so ndakazosiana onazvo ama dzangu ndiya mureyu doita sei mkadzi wangu ndo muda zvino ari kuti let's separate uite zvavari kuda because life is too short ndiri kurwadzi wa hanzva dzangu That keo wavaida kuti ndirora asata arorwao so ndapererwa kuna mata about it i have tried but zviri kurwadza ndodi iko hamadzangu makambosangana herina zvakadai kubva zvamakabereko